Here in the Tennessee Valley, doctors are asking COVID patients not to go to the emergency room unless symptoms are really severe. This is because of the recent spike in cases. Our Elise Zwick joins us live with an update. Elise. That's right, David. Chattanooga's three major hospitals are teaming up to tell the public about COVID-19 testing. Don't go to the emergency room unless you have a major emergency. We're stretched extremely thin. Dr. Jensen Hyde, an MD with the Erlanger Health System, says people come to the emergency room with symptoms like a runny nose, cough, or no symptoms at all, requesting a COVID-19 test. With the strain on current health care workers, these requests are overwhelming the department. People that use the ER as their primary care, even outside of a crisis situation. And so some of that's just a pattern of use as well. You know, we've seen people come to the ER to get pregnancy tests. You know, it's, it's not an appropriate use of the resource. Um, but at the same time, we took an oath and feel very strongly about taking care of each and every patient that comes through the doors. But our ability to do that is very stressed right now. With hospitals short staffed and the Omicron variant more transmissible, this current wave of COVID-19 infections is impacting the availability to help other patients in need of ER services. The sheer transmissibility is a huge challenge because it means that numerically, we're still seeing a lot of patients sick enough to be in the hospital, which stresses all of the service lines and in particular the emergency department. To help reduce some of this strain, local hospitals say yeah. to only visit the ER if you are experiencing shortness of breath and other severe symptoms. If you're having minor symptoms, visit your primary care doctor or a local testing facility instead of a visit to the ER. Reporting live in Chattanooga, Elise Zwick, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.